We're going to go straight into the best features of Mortec. I mentioned a moment ago data sovereignty, and it's becoming massive in marketing and CRM in any kind of world is where is your data being hosted? Where is your data sitting around this world? And yes, lots of people say AWS and everything else, but the beauty about Mortec is that you can choose. You can choose, you can you can host Mautic on your own servers, on your own stack. You can put it up in Azure, AWS. You can go to Mautic Direct, or you can speak to us. We have Mautic on Enable Cloud for the UK customers. So there's lots of different, different aspects, but really when we look at data, Mautic is about kind of keeping it in the place where you need it to be. So if you had, um, I don't know, certain securities, maybe in, in the uh, Middle East, you can host Mautic there quite happily, where you can't do for the other proprietary systems where you're, you're bound to where they want you to be. One of my great features about Mautic that I love um, is the heat map and be able to see what part of your email is getting the most attention and yeah. what part of the email is maybe lacking the most attention and maybe not actually needed anymore. I think it's a good way to for a marketer uh, or for a whole marketing team to see what is working and what isn't working with your marketing. What What is catching people's eyes and what isn't catching people's eyes. And I think that can really help plan your future campaigns going forward. Yeah, the heat map is really good. If you go to a Mautic system and you go down to emails, the heat map is actually in the email itself. So it'll be just, this is a dummy email, but if you go up to the top right on the options, you can click on heat map. It brings up a, a kind of a, a view of that email you're sending out and it will give kind of that, that kind of cold to hot scenario of how far someone got around the page or where they clicked on what links, etc. And it is really powerful in that aspect because not many marketing tools actually have this, to be honest here. Not that I'm aware of. So it is a really cool feature. Tell me a bit more about A-B testing. Show me about A-B testing. What do you mean by A-B testing? So when it comes down to A-B testing, I think more to do it great because it allows you to select your emails on the fly and also if you have any templates you can so when it comes down to a b testing if you want to see which type of email works better you know having that a b testing to see you know for these groups of people that send out you know for example one that maybe has a video where in example two it doesn't have a video you can then see is the video enticing people more to click it and actually view it and learn more about whatever you're trying to market yeah. rather than maybe they just like to read a quick email, see all the points and then just go straight for it. I think A-B testing is really good for that. I think Mortic supports A-B testing in a very user-friendly way. So when the other one is tracking, everyone thinks about tracking URLs. What Mortic does in tracking any kind of link, what it's actually put into an email or into a marketing message or a channel, will automatically track so if somebody clicks on it you'll automatically know that they they clicked on it and then if you have and we'll go into campaigns in a minute but if you had a campaign what was maybe alerting someone or someone's just maybe clicked on an email you could do so so it, it does get really quite powerful in that aspect on that click mapping i think another good thing about mortic is the placeholder tags i think in the email that you showed example you can see here that we have hi and then curly brackets contact field equal first name i think having the ability to just pull data out from the from the record of the you know the contact or the lead uh, and making that email more personalized um i think is just a great feature at all i love it so much i think it saves a lot of time for our marketing team where they're able to produce a nice email but instead of you know writing john adam anything like that in the email subject it just automatically does it for you you can even put in like your signature like for here for in this email for example it's automatically going to put in the the signature of who's sending it yeah so it's 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 more about saving time and i think that's why i love it more because it gives you time back in the day to do other things and let the let the marketing system do what it's meant to do and automate things that's really cool. The, the beauty, the other thing about that tagging, that field tags, Mautic doesn't have any kind of um, limitations to the amount of fields you can put in. So if you had your own custom fields, maybe you were asking for an interest or something like this, you could create the field and use that data to populate an email. So it's just not the default fields that you can use in the marketing tags. You can also use custom as well. And you can do this all yourself. It's all um, no code, low code in that aspect.